You feel me? Now I've I've been started this Q and A um thing like a long time ago, and this specific Q and A was supposed to be done like. Let me see. I screenshotted it September second, so this was about two weeks ago. <laughs> this is about two weeks ago. Um, but yeah. We're going to call this Zace the Q&A Sick Edition because I'm definitely sick as hell. But the first question, what's the... <laughs> like, bro, this is how we starting off. I mean, I did say ask me whatever y'all want to know. But like, god damn, my nigga. You feel what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. Calm down, dude. Calm down, dude. Calm down, dude. Calm down, dude. All right, anywho. Let me start tweaking out. Where the hell the questions go? I just seen them in my face. Where'd they go? Hold up. What? Bro, where the questions go? Oh, all right. Anywho, from the homie, Strictly Main. Main pain. Main pain with the child going straight down. You know what I'm saying? What's the freakiest shit you ever did? Like, bro, what the fuck? Like, why you wanna know that, man? How you wanna know? Why you wanna know how I get? That's a guess gay. That's gay. I'm your brother. And you wanna know how I get? That's gay. You wanna know what I do so you can try to kidnap me and make me do it to you, you little freak ass boy. I ain't playing with you, nigga. Shit get wicked. Anywho. Since you want to know so bad. Freakiest thing I ever did. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I really did nothing, honestly. I haven't done too much. I just be chilling. I really... Actually, I'm lying. I licked my girl face yesterday. Is that bad? I don't think that's bad. Cause like, actually no, it wasn't her face. I licked her neck from here, like, from like, hold up. I went from like here to, oh, wait, that's not even a, all right. I went from like here to like here. Like, yeah, I went like that. You see that little, let me turn, you see this, this, this tendon right here? Yeah, it was like that. I went from the bottom all the way to the top. I didn't even go slow. I just did it in one swift motion. Is that crazy, chat? I don't think that's crazy. And that's not even freaky for real. I'm just weird. Like, when I was a jit, you know, I ain't even about to tell y'all that. Don't even worry about that. Just know I'm weird. Like, but yeah, we was chilling, sitting down, and I just licked her neck. I mean, I guess... That's the freest thing I ever done. Licked her neck from the bottom to the top. All right, from Still Sleepy J, aka Pluto, aka Jeremiah. Do it, jiggle. Let me four K him real quick. Get the fuck out of here, you sh yo, Jeremiah. You gay. You gay. Yo, boss. Yo, boss. Not gonna lie. You might be gay. He, he just might be gay. He might be gay. He, he, you might be gay. Is he gay, chat? Yo, Jeremiah. Yo, you, you might be gay, bro. <laughs> you might be gay, bro. <laughs> You're gay, bro. <laughs> gay ass nigga. Anywho. I ain't answering that. All right. From Twinum, a.k.a. Barbs, a.k.a. Summer, top 10 flyest niggas in Bassett High School, which is my high school. You feel what I'm saying? Word. Now, I do this on my story all the time. I'm going to just keep it 100. I don't think nobody in my school fucking with my swag. Let me just get that out the way right now. And I'm going to show y'all what I mean right now. Hold up. I don't think no nigga in my school got better swag than me. 
I don't care how y'all feel about what I'm saying in Bassett. I don't care. I don't care. Nobody in my school got better swag than me. I do not care what you have to say. Peep, and I'm about to explain why. All right? Let's go Let's go through the highlight real quick. Feel me? You peep the swag. Ken Carson filter. X filter. X belt. Gothic cropped long sleeve. Rick Owens. Rip jeans. They're not stacked. They're just they're just baggy. You know what I'm saying? Come on now. This was 20. This was this was a year ago. This was a year ago to the week. This is the same week I took this. 52 weeks is in a year. That's crazy that I did this on the same week. Anywho, my possibly the same day. You feel me? But look, peep the swag. 52 weeks ago. This was a year ago. I was still swagging it on. Next. We got, we got the songs muted because, you know what I'm saying, we're not trying to get copyrighted. But, polo, rainbow polo. Um, not rainbow for real, but like, multicolored polo. Bread, patent bread ones. Black jeans. Swaggy. Now go back. Swaggy. Feel what I'm saying? Word. Calm fit, though. These are calm fits. Hold on. We ain't get to the crazy ones yet. These are calm fits. This is a school fit. That this is a school fit. I wore this to school. Where you think I was going 52 weeks ago with this on walking? I went to school. Went to school. In school. That's a school floor. Rick Owens. I love my babies. That's when they was pristine. Rick Owens. Black jeans. Gradient polo. Stop playing with them. Next. Rick Owens. You about to see a lot of those, by the way. Rick Owens. Adidas sweats. Long sleeve that I do not own anymore. Nadia, this is now your long sleeve. You probably still wear it. I hope you do. Anyways. Back to what I was saying. Where was I going this day? I don't even know. But you want to know what song I was using? That was cringy as hell. Anywho. Next fit. or That's not really a fit. This wasn't really a fit either, but it was black Tims, black jeans, and a cap of like, I don't know what it's called. It was like some, some I don't know, it was some weird jacket. Patent bread ones, black jeans with the goddamn, you feel me? The little us, us, us spider uh, long sleeve, you feel me? Next fit, that's not really a fit. Oh, we ain't gonna talk, no, y'all gonna see that fit, hold up, y'all gonna see that. Calm fit, Rick Owen, black jeans, Playboy shirt, feel me? Nothing crazy. Now, now we get to the actual crazy fits. We get to the real fits. The real fits are the ones I post, by the way. Now, this was like the first time I wore the Rick Owens. Peep, peep. Neon tour, long sleeve. You don't see those. You don't see that. Nowhere. Oh, God. I'm the only body. I'm the only person in Bridgeport with that long sleeve. Nobody can say they have that in my city but me. I'm the only nigga in my city with that long sleeve. Let me make that clear. Oh, God. Hold on. And I swag that on, too. Niggas be collecting this. Nah, nigga, I swag it on any chance I get. Tell them. Playboy, long sleeve. I got the bunnies on this side. I got the females on that side. And there's some Chinese lettering right there. But feel me? Everybody was telling me, oh, why you ain't wearing blue shoes? Because I'm not a sandwich method type of nigga. I'm going to wear the patent bread. Peep the fit. Peep the fit. Oh, my God. YVL. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh my god, oh my god. Look at the game. Look at Kali Oh my god. Talking about who the fly. What I what I put Say what I put you talking about? I was out. It get wicked. Anywho, continuing. Now we doing the sandwich method. Simpsons. We went Simpsons on them with the UNC fours. Come on, chat. Yeah. Tell him, look at me. Yeah. Come on. Hey, 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 nigga. Damn, peep the, peep the, oh my God. Oh, oh my God, with the Ricks again. Killing them with the Ricks, oh my God. Again, the gradient polo with gray jeans and a hat. Killed them, killed them, killed them. This fit right here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Here on X Games mode. 
Feel what I'm saying? Black Timberlands. Black Timberlands with the black leathers. With the X belt. The Calvin Klein windbreaker. Feel me? With the do-rag. The do-rag with the hoodie. Oh, bro. With the fresh retweet. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hell, ass games, bro. Like, somebody come get me. Oh, my goodness. Yo. Shout out my nigga Cat. Shout out my nigga CJ, bro. Shit, my nigga took these. And I, I, man, I dropped the album for this, nigga. I did not drop that deluxe, though. I ain't about to lie. Anywho, feel me? Go crazy with them again with the Ricks. I keep killing them. I'm smacking these niggas with the Ricks over and over and over again. These niggas talking about, ooh, you got to me. Nigga, I'm wearing the same thing. I got mad kicks I could wear. And I'm wearing these same few kicks. And I'm rubbing these niggas' eyes, bro. Peep the fit. Oh, my God. They asked me, bro, why you got a red hat on? Where's the red? Nigga, you don't see that red in that tag down there, nigga? Stop playing with me, nigga. I peeps all the colors, and it still looks tough. Y'all niggas just hate it. Shout out my nigga Choco. Shout out my nigga Jew. Shout out my nigga Darren. Oh, God. Anywho. I almost threw up. You get my point. I could pull off any aesthetic. I could, You want the trap hood, nigga? Be, not even. That's not even trap for real, like... Hold up, hold up, hold up. All right, you want you want the the opium aesthetic? Boom, boom. Hold up, back up. You want the little little little, little trap star little hood? Boom, little trap star pose right there. Boom, 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 boom. little trap star pose. Like, come on, bro. Nobody. I'm definitely in that top ten. But I'm I'm gonna just name off a list of top tens. If you name out on this list, I don't really care, bro. I'm gonna keep it a hundred. So look, we got me throwing me in there. Fly niggas. <laughs> it's kind of hard. I ain't gonna lie. Shit. I can't even be biased for real to say all my niggas. Because it's like... <sighs> I gotta be realistic right now. Alright. Throw me in there. Um, Throw my nigga Mason in there. Not the one that graduated. Because he don't count. Me, my nigga Mason. Throw, throw Austin in there. Throw throw Khalil in there, cause he's still in it. Throw Khalil in there. Um throw Derek in there. Throw Derek in there. I'll throw him there. Um this ain't in no order either. I ain't if you want me to order it, then I'm gonna put myself at number one and it's not gonna be fair because it's the truth. Anyways, so yeah, me, Mason, Austin, Derek, Khalil. God damn. I can't do no top ten. Who the fuck else go to basic? That's drippy, bro. Like Nobody really be throwing that shit on. And she said niggas. She said niggas. She did not say females. Um, I might got to end the list right there. I'm going to keep it 100. I can't think of nobody else that be throwing that shit on, bro. Like, uh, I can't think of nobody. <laughs> shit, throw Darren in there. Yeah, throw Darren. That's six. Julian don't be trying. I can't throw him in there. My nigga don't be trying, bro. Like, if he start trying, I feel like he can make that list. Let me check my followers, bro. Hold up. Do I see anybody in here that go to my school, bro? Like, see, bro. See, I can't throw nobody else, bro. Come on. See, bro. Nobody else could get thrown in here, bro. See? See? Like, who else am I going to throw in here, bro? I can't throw nobody else. I can only do six people. I'm not going to lie. I can only do six people. It's really only six niggas in my school who really throw that shit off. And I even name niggas that, like, I don't even, like, be around too much. Like, but I could just, I just know. It's only six niggas in Basic that really be throwing that shit on. And if you got a problem with me, oh, fucking well. Because I'm just keeping it 100. Word. Like, yeah, you could throw on a damn... Uh, 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 a damn Nike hoodie. So, uh, <coughs> what the f Oh, nah. See, I'm about to die. See, I'm about to die. In GTA, I'm about to blow up. My shit about to explode. Oh, nah. Anywho, yeah, I can only do six niggas. Some niggas just be throwing on Nike text and shit with a shicey combo. Oh, I'm the dripper. You know the fuck you're not. You're not shit. Back up. Anywho, damn, look at my nose. Oh, blow my nose. Um, all right, 
uh, summer again. Top 10 baddest females in Basic. I will not be rating any other females besides mine. But, but, honestly, okay, chat, clearly, all right, let me, let me, let me say something real quick. <laughs> let me say something real quick. <laughs> all right, chat, y'all gotta realize, bro. Okay, okay, look. Clearly, chat, y'all know I'm talking to somebody, right? Right. Okay. Cool. Y'all know I'm talking to somebody. All right. Now, I can't say the top 10 baddest females in my school. And what I'm about to say going to sound crazy. And there's no offense to anybody. But, like, I don't find nobody in my school bad. Why you think I'm not fucking with nobody in my school? <laughs> <laughs> if I found somebody in my school bad, you think I would be talking to my shorty who go to school in motherfucking the forest? <laughs> the fuck? I mean, me though, I'm going to be nice. I'm a, yeah, I'm gonna cut y'all some slack. Y'all not ugly. Y'all just not for me. Can I do a top 10 baddest? Fuck no. As long as you know you bad though. Where it's all a mental thing. It don't matter what I say. So, can I answer that question? Um, Next question. The homie Ja. The first time. Hold up. Yeah. Okay. So from the homie Ja. The first time you got in crazy trouble. Ooh boy. <laughs> this is a little story time for y'all, man. Where that boy said? Where that boy said? He said, he said, he said. Street, man. From the work down the street, man. Come on, hurry up, man. I would. He said. He said. He said. I would all that, man. I would all that, man. I would all that, man. <laughs> Let me stop. The fuck. Anywho, bro. So, the first time I ever got in crazy trouble, I say this story takes place in like two thousand and. 12, I want to say, like 20, yeah, like 2011, 2012, we was living, where was my family living? We was living on the street, literally two blocks down from where I'm at right now. I done moved all around the world, but like, I'm back in this area again. But uh, we was living on a street um, called Catherine Street, which really isn't, I mean, I don't really care, y'all niggas not pulling up. So, Anyways, we was living on the street. And on the street. Or no, let me let me let me talk about something else first. So at around this time, I was about 2008, I was about five five, six years old. Four or five, six years old. No, four or five years old, right? So I'm four or five years old. Actually, I was four turning five. I'm pretty sure, because this was the middle of summer. Yes. So I was four turning five. Mm. And the people that was in this neighborhood were like way older than me. Like I'm four turning five. They're like 12 going on 13. You feel what I'm saying? Like these niggas are way older than me. So I'm hanging around niggas that's like double my age and shit. You know, these niggas, you know what I'm saying? They teenagers. They going around the the hood and shit for me. They doing all the dance challenges. They got all the fits. They got the Jordans, the this, the that, the goddamn KDs and shit. Back then was hot niggas. Feel me going around hooping and shit. You feel me? Like so, I'm chilling around with these niggas. But my family told me that I was specifically not allowed to leave the street. Like I was, I was not allowed to pass a certain house, and I wasn't allowed to go around the corner. 
fine. So one day I'm hanging out with these niggas and behind my house, it was a field of grass and there was a gate that led to that field of grass. So I'm with the group of niggas and it's about like four or five of them, right? Four or five, four, four or five of them, me making it six. So we all like, they talking this shit, feel me? I'm young. I can't really say nothing for real. So I'm just sitting there absorbing the conversation. And then they looked at me. And he was like, you want to come with us? And I'm like, shit, fuck it. So they wanted to hop the gate, which they did. They wanted to hop the gate and run through the grass field to get to the next street. Peep, I wasn't allowed to leave the street. So they literally, or one of them was like, he don't know how to climb gates. And I was like, I don't, like, I, I didn't, I was four years old. So they was like, all right, one of y'all got to carry him. Nigga, what? I kid you not, the biggest nigga in this group, I forgot the nigga name, bro, but he had to be about like, if I remember him clearly, he had to be about like, like six foot at the age of like 14, bro. Nigga hoisted me up with one arm. Hopped the gate and was running through the grass field with me in his arm. The grass wasn't super high. It was like moderately high. It was like knee, like right above knee level. And he's running with me through the grass. I'm like, oh, nah. So we all on the other street just ch chopping it up, talking. You hear my mom on the other street behind us, the street we just came from, the one I wasn't allowed to leave, screaming my name at the top of her lungs. I'm like, oh, nah. So... They like, oh yeah, he gotta go back home. So then we just running around the corner this time. Like, the 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 grass field isn't even that long. They just didn't want to go all the way around the corner, which I don't know why, but like they just jumped the gate. So this time we went back around the corner. Soon as I got in my mama here, she mink, 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 mink. Wow. Smack my booty up. My booty was all over the place. Pause. A mother. Fucking yo. So she what my told me to go in the house. Literally 30 minutes later told me I could go right back outside. That was like the first time I got in trouble though. Like I was really crying. Like I was badly crying. I was crying very badly. Cause I was like, like, she tried to make it seem like I ran away from home and shit. I'm like, bro, I went to the next street. She like, oh my baby already running from home. She he already in the streets. And my I guess my grandma probably talked to her and was like, let that boy back outside. But, um, yeah, that's the first time I ever really got in trouble when, um, my family, um, caught me on the street I wasn't supposed to be on. But, yeah, that's a little mini story time, nothing too crazy. But I think that's going to sum up our Q&A. You know, we had a pretty good Q&A. Um, some calm questions, nothing too crazy this time.